Good morning, boys and girls. Happy Sabbath to you. This morning story comes from the book, The Adventures of Robert and Ruth. And the story is titled, The Pandemic, Family Worship, and the Rainbow. I hope you're sitting okay. So now I'm going to begin. Once upon a time, the Murray family, the Duncan family, the Cheddar family, the Gale family, the Hamming family decided to have a Zoom Sabbath worship. There was a pandemic everywhere, in America, in China, in Jamaica, in England, in Trinidad, in Barbados, there was a pandemic everywhere and everyone had to practice social distancing. Well, Robert and Ruth could not wait for the family worship. Robert looked like his sister Ruth and Ruth looked like her brother Robert. They were twins. The family Members giggled as they sang their worship song. Ebony said, I love singing. Robert says, Ben, you sound funny when you sing. Marcia said, well, that's because of the Zoom delay. And all the family members giddled. Asa said, I'd like to play a song and my guitar. Carl said, I'll join you, Asta. I'll play my guitar also. Rosemary rocked from side to side as she listened and enjoyed the duet by Asta and Carl. Karen Delmarie said, Oh, I just love these family worships. Tony said, yeah, it is wonderful having these get together online. And it is amazing and powerful hearing stories of how God loves us and protects us and just wants to keep us safe. Leanne said, God showed Noah and his family a rainbow. Do you remember that? Everyone nodded their heads. Ryan said, what was the purpose of the rainbow? Ruth and cousin Kimberly raised their hands. Ruth said, Genesis 9, 13 reads, I set my rainbow in the cloud and it shall be a sign of a covenant between me and the earth. So God has given us a rainbow. It's a promise between him and us. Walter said, good answer. What does God want us to understand about the rainbow? Kimberly said, Genesis 9 verse 15 reminds us that God said, I will remember my covenant, which is a sign between me and you and every living creature on the earth. Pastor Hamming said, I can see you guys really understand your scripture. He continued, God has the right solutions for our concerns and for our fears. Noah preached and the people ignored his sermon. But the animals listened to God and they entered the ark. And then God closed the door of the ark and then the floods came. And after the flood, the people were scared and they thought, what are we going to do if there's another flood? and God put a rainbow up in the sky. And the rainbow was more sparkling 
than a 4th of July firework display. And God put the rainbow in the sky to remind us not to be afraid and to let us know that he has a covenant with us. He has a promise with us. The rainbow is a sign to help us to remember that God's promises are true and we can depend on them. And so boys and girls, I would like to encourage you today to draw a picture of a rainbow and color it in all the beautiful colors that you have and put the rainbow on your refrigerator or keep it in your room. And each time you look at the rainbow, it will remind you that God has a promise with us and he will never again destroy this earth with a flood. The end. Let us pray. Dear Jesus, thank you so much for loving us. Thank you so much for listening to our concerns. And dear Jesus, thank you for the rainbow that you put in the sky to remind us that you have a promise with us. You have a covenant with us that you will never again destroy this earth with a flood. And Jesus, please help all the boys and girls that they will continue to have a wonderful Sabbath day. Amen. Who made the rainbow? That's right, God did. And why did he make it? That's right, he made it as a promise to us to tell us that he loves us. Should we sing about it in Who Made the Beautiful Rainbow? children hope you're all okay and um, today's song is behold i stand at the door and knock so i hope you enjoy it and join in with the actions okay here we go behold behold i stand at the door and knock 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 behold behold i stand at the door and knock 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 if anyone hears my voice if anyone is my voice, they will open, open, open the door and let me in. Behold, behold, I stand at the door and knock, knock, knock. Behold, behold, I stand at the door and knock, knock, knock. If anyone is my voice, if anyone is my voice, they will open, open, open the door and let me in. Hope you enjoyed that. See you later. Bye.